Last night, we showed you how the horse racing industry is working to make the sport safer for the horses. Now, America's leader in equine care and research is getting up to speed in caring for the jockeys. LEX18's Michael Burke has what they're doing at UK's Sports Science Lab. 100 pounds soaking wet, and they hop aboard 1,000 pound thoroughbreds as part of their daily routine. Yet no one really seems all too concerned with their well-being until now. We have a specialized lab um, focused on the rider. Inside UK's Sports Medicine Research Institute, Carl Maticola and the Jockey Equestrian Initiative he leads are ahead of the pack when assessing a jockey's physical health and their ability to assist and speed injury recovery. Various tests can give them a solid baseline for where they stand when they're seated. Just come in and get tested and see where you're at uh, fitness wise and what you need to do to maintain a level of fitness. I think it's really good for the young riders. Young riders like Jose Ortiz, who's taking part in the Keeneland Spring Meet and will be aboard a few horses on Derby Saturday. I think it helps a lot because sometimes you go down and you don't know you have a concussion and the next thing you do is jump back on a horse. A dangerous scenario for the horse, the rider, and the competitors around them. You want to have a pilot who has the best performance and also has has been provided the best skill set. If only Mr. Day had this back in his day. It would help you to maintain the fitness. It would enable you to continue to compete at that upper level. Covering the news in Lexington, Michael Burke, LEX 18 News.